Hey guys, Steve here from the Cook Family Homestead on this cold, rainy morning. <laughs> so I thought today would be a good day to put a gate, if you can see there, that's the entrance to our garden here, if you can see, and I'm gonna put a gate on there and I'm gonna make it. So I figured I'd take you along and show you how I'm making this gate. It's gonna be about four feet high by about 54 inches wide, so. We'll get that, and it's also gonna be one that you can hang on a T-post, so uh, I think I got the right, right stuff to do it, so I'm gonna kinda improvise here. So, see if we can make this work. All right, so what I have here is some, um, these right here are two by threes, cause I wanna just, I don't want a heavy, heavy duty gate. The back gate I'm gonna be making is gonna be made out of two by fours. And uh, what we're gonna do is, I'm gonna get those all cut down here on the miter saw, but we're gonna cut two of them, basically an eight footer here in half, and then we're gonna cut two uh, 54 inches long. And so let's get that started. It's about 54 inches across by about uh, 53. It's not quite a square, almost about one inch off, but 53. These are 48 inches, but I butted them up against the top here and bottom. So that made about 53. Uh, nice and sturdy, but nice and light too. I didn't want a heavy gate. So um, one of the things we're going to do is I'm gonna cut the wire for it now. We're gonna use the welded wire that we used uh, for our fencing around the garden. Uh, it's kind of a lighter wire. And then just real quick of how I attach these. Uh, I have these angles here, I don't know if you can see. I had two of them I found uh, that I just had laying around. So I put one there, one here, and then I put a, uh, uh, another deck screw in each side here and it, it's really sturdy. Well, that's what the gate looks like all painted. We'll let that dry for a little bit and then we'll paint the back side. So now I gotta figure out how I'm gonna hang this. I think I have an idea here though, so I'll show you. All right guys, so let me show you uh, what my plan was and it actually is gonna work good. Uh, so I went to Tractor Supply and I bought these. These are uh, for chain link fencing the pipe. This is the smallest one you can get. You can get two sizes. One's bigger than this. Uh, but I thought about it, maybe I could clamp this down on a T-post. I, I was just guessing and uh, it actually works really good. It clamps right down on there, if you can see. I don't even have it tight and it's really tight. I still have a little ways to go. But I do have one issue. So this will get mounted on the actual gate. So the there's two holes there to screw it on, and this is what it will pivot on, but here is my issue. 
if you can see this. So this will sit in there and be able to turn. Now it will clear it barely though. Like it does catch a little bit. So what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna modify this just a little bit. Let me get zoomed in there. So I'm going to take a little bit off the edge here and grind it off. So. Bends nice in there. All right, let's get the other one ground. And I think we got some hinges. All right, here is our gate, all complete. So as you can see over here, here are our hinges. They actually worked really good. And I zip tied this post to this post to kind of make it a little more sturdier. But these hinges work great on here. So if you're looking to do one on a T post, these will work. Uh, they work actually really good. And just a little latch on here and you can open it and I have a little piece of rebar in the ground there to kind of stop it from hitting the fence and kind of we're on like a little bit of a slant here on this side of the garden so gravity helps the gate here but very easy to close and close it up and there you are I like it. You like it? Mm -hmm. Okay, we'll do a walkthrough of the gate coming this way so we'll see what it looks like on this side. I think it turned out good. I do too. Like the color of it. Walk in. <clears throat> There's our gate. And our coming along garden. All right, well, there it is. <clears throat> Thanks for watching. God bless y'all.